This is Lola Lee T. Hey everyone, how are you guys doing? So Krishan Rock's sisters are in town. Krishan flew her sisters out to film with her, most likely for season two of Crazy in Love. They both made no secret of this by sharing it on their Instagram. Get your neck on. Get your neck on. Let me put my neck on. You got my favorite color, which is trade. You want to switch? Yeah, hell yeah. Y'all was my shit. All right, well, I came from Bootsy Valley. You can take that one. It's much hard. No, this. Oh, my God. This bitch is a no cap and no. And that was snap. You want to do it? Hell no, no. I love Cali. I love Cali. They make local mojos. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. But what is concerning is both are not staying at Krishan's home that she shares with Blueface. They are staying at a hotel, which makes me wonder if everything is okay. Is everyone getting along? Who knows? Maybe something happened when they filmed. Something else that is very concerning is Krishan's sister said, I hate when my little sister is crying and I can't hold her. Now, we all know that they're filming Krishan's Baby Journey, season two of Crazy in Love, and Krishan shared this in an Instagram Live back in January. Okay, Zeus Network about to set up my whole baby journey, because we about to make it a whole nother season. So that's going to be a whole nother... Hold up a bro, but it's gonna be a lot of content for a lot of stuff yeah, like that. Is. So I'm excited. I'm gonna show up. Right. Show up and get bigger. Right. 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 And me and Blue are working on that. You're going to be able to have your own network, even with the baby. Like, what's that going to be called? Like, baby, baby. <laughs> it's going to be the Blue Rock Network. It's going to say Blue Rock Network. And this should be a really happy time for Krishan. And rumor has it that they were filming her baby gender reveal. Not sure how true that is, but we will find out when the show airs. Anyway, the last thing that Krishan needs right now is to be stressed out and crying. That's not good for her or the baby. Her baby feels what she feels. And when I was pregnant and if I was stressed, I could literally feel my baby tensing up. But I'm actually happy that Krishan has flown her sisters out. So yes, please send love and prayers to Krishan. Send those love and prayers her way. What are your thoughts about all of that? And one more thing in regards to this ultrasound and picture of Blueface's mom kissing a belly. I did make a video about that yesterday. Anyway, Miss Carlissa never put a name to the images. She never said it was Krishan's baby or Krishan's belly. And in my humble opinion, I don't think that that was an accident. I think that was on purpose. Just my opinion. All this speculation is really good for Krishan and Blueface's show and also for Miss Carlissa's upcoming show as well. So when she was on Instagram Live yesterday, she was asked to clarify actually multiple times by different people. And she was asked if any of the images she posted had anything to do with Krishan. Listen to what she had to say.
I missed it. I, I feel like Carlissa is the type that has to be humbled and like, baby, when I tell you humbling, I, I've been humbled. You ain't seen my <laughs> kids out here on the damn streets. <laughs> you don't get no more humble than that. I'm, I'm going through my shit, boo. <laughs> Oh, all everybody wants to know is who Belly that was. Mm-hmm. Y'all is just going to have to tune in. No, I'm not pregnant. I'm not pregnant. <laughs> I'm not pregnant. It ain't Selena. It ain't me. <laughs> you can be passionate about something that you care about. Yes, you can. But that's not the, de- it's the delivery. Now, y'all can keep doing it if you want to. I don't care if you get a man or not. I don't care if you stay single and end up on the couch like your big mama and your mama. You can listen or you can not listen. Okay, I'm just going to tell y'all you ain't got to talk that loud. You ain't got to be screaming and hollering at no man about cheating. That's how you lose them. That's how you lose them. Nobody want to hear all of that. As soon as they hear all of that, they over here going over um Sarah house. Like, no, nobody want to hear that. If somebody was yelling at you like that every single day and it was a man or a woman, you would want to leave too. Yeah. It's your delivery. Bitch, if you're leaving, you're leaving, you're leaving. You're leaving, you're leaving. If you're staying, you're staying. Make up your mind. You can't sit there and be yelling and screaming about it all damn day long. Mm-hmm. Don't nobody want to hear all that. How about how strong you is and your mama was a Black Panther party. Come on. You know, nobody. We know what we get ourselves into. Yeah. You know what you get, get yourself ourselves. into. Yeah. You done brought your ass over there and sat on that bed. And now, you you know, you can't. You got to, you got to, mm-hmm. you either you in or you out. Okay. And I, like I told her on the show yesterday, under 30, you shouldn't be expecting nobody to be in because ain't nobody mature enough. Especially as a man. Especially, maybe, maybe the women. Us. Maybe women might be ready, but you're not going to find no man ready under 30. So devote your time and yourself and all of that power to the people and all of that loud shit you got going on. You may as well use that to get a law degree or something. But yelling and screaming at a man all day for free, baby, that ain't, it ain't going to mm-hmm. work. I say late 30s. Late 30s for men, for sure. Er, maybe early 30s for women. So if you're 30, you should be looking for somebody like around about 35, 36 years old. Yeah. Okay? He ready to mm-hmm. stop. He ready to uh, take life seriously. And He got his fun, fun out the way. Pretty much. <laughs> yeah, because they're going to get their fun out the way. Yeah. Whether you like it or not. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean, unless you get luck up out of that, what, that 1% that Russell... But I think Russell might have been having a situation before Sierra, so he was, must have been doing something too. Oh, they just, always what they want us to see. Exactly. I'm behind closed doors. But you I don't get you gonna be that little dog in the litter box like your grandma and your big mama if you, if you keep talking talking crazy like that and thinking that you got it all together because you don't. Mm-hmm. Yeah, avoiding our question. I'm not avoiding your question. I just said check it out on Six Off. Yeah, you're just going to have to tune in. You have to tune in. Man, I can't tell y'all. Somebody going to have a baby. <laughs> That's all anybody wants to know. I know. Selena did that, didn't she? I woke up like, mm-hmm. Girl, Mrs. Sappho woke up calling me Tiffany. You <laughs> said, who that, that is? <laughs> Who this woman getting in my bed? <laughs> Somebody said it must be Jaden. Mm-hmm. Was it, it Jaden? Blue face must got his mama hair done. <laughs> okay. Yes, Lena pregnant. That's her stepdaughter. My other daughter-in-law pregnant? That was a that was a, a black baby. Is that, belly. Is, that was a black person belly. I see a whole lot of it's Selena's baby. They, they, they manifesting on you, Selena. They better uh, uh, <laughs> her other son is having a baby. Most definitely was Krishan Belly. It's his stepdaughter that's pregnant. Oh, You're too Hey, mama, I know. Thank you, baby. I'm trying to be funny. She wants you to... I don't want you to think nothing. I want you to think for yourself. Thank you, baby. We all should know. 
That was my first baby belly. Huh? Girl, you know I can't see this. What they say? Tune in. There you go, baby. The mama is their new cast member on Six Odds. <laughs> Who was it? <laughs> Who was it? Somebody got thought to be pushing. Mm. I'm just excited. I'm so excited. Is that why you got three baby daddies? Either you can learn from me <laughs> or you can sit on the couch like your mama and big mama. Because oh, you big mouth bitches mama is on the couch. <laughs> Let's trying to figure out how to pay them bills by her goddamn self for 50 years now. I guarantee it. Practice what you preach. Get up here like you preaching gospel. Who? What? This ain't no gospel. <laughs> this is everyday black woman problems. What you talking about? Did you see me quote any scriptures? You want some gospel? I can give you some gospel. But right now, I'm just trying to help you with these babies. Is Jaden pregnant? Where can I tune in? Who's TikTok? And is it blue? Carlissa when the Megan interview coming out. I think I want to say I seen Sunday today, but some behind the scenes stuff just went up. That's pretty funny. I was real on there. I just told the whole truth and nothing but the truth. So help me God. That's all I plan to do and have a good time. Callie old belly pit. I Callie kind of wish she was that small, but okay. <laughs> now nah, I ain't take no old belly pick. Callie's baby belly pick. What mm -hmm. is it? Uh, that on Callie too? Right. You don't. Uh -uh. <laughs> Who is the girl on the live with you? So Selena is my makeup artist slash my assistant. She's on production for Six Art, and she's doing an amazing, fantastic job. She made sure my belly wasn't too much out last night. <laughs> she's awesome, and I love her. And I love you, too. Where are my teeth biting the strip, Selena? They're still in the car. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go find them. Okay, y'all. Y'all have a blast. Is it Tuesday? Or Wednesday. It, it, oh, it's Wednesday. She, she starts shooting as soon as Mother's Day is over. And Callie is back from her her cruise. We got some good stuff coming, y'all. We're going to find out why Callie got to go to court. We're going to find out what Dre is going to do with his life, child, after prison, after lockup. We're going to find out how the mama is going to handle all of this and not get a bald spot on my wig. <laughs> Um, we're going to find out how Mrs. Sappho feels about all of this bullshit. Um, what else? We're going to find out if Dre got a secret somebody. We're going to find out if me and Tokyo Tony go over there and um, talk the paper Mr. Blueface house or not. Where you at, girl? I'm ready. I done bought my outfit, my cat suit to go up over there and um, commit a crime. So your hair is giving, Selena. Yes, isn't her hair gorgeous, y'all? Oh, that she said, Selena, your hair is giving. Oh, thank you. They are filming for a show that's definitely for Sean. Jaden is black. I thought she's mixed. So you got black, and then you got mixed. Selena mixed, she mixed, they mixed. I'm black though. You can count on that. <laughs> <laughs> She's too happy. Yes, child. Girl, when you get your hair done, you be happy that I'm like, don't you? <laughs> I don't hear y'all talking about my hair. Where's Jay at? I don't hear y'all talking about my hair. I don't hear y'all talking about my hair today. <laughs> nobody said it's cute or nothing. All y'all been saying is look fucked up. But ain't nobody saying my hair is cute. Y'all starting to look like haters in these comments. <laughs> is Callie pregnant? Now, how in the hell Callie going to be pregnant? She in medical school. All for 
TV. All for you, baby. Not TV. All for you. Your hair is lovely. Brock should be about four or five months. Did that belly look four or five or six months? I don't know. Going once, going twice. Let me hear y'all. What the belly looking like? Four, five, six, belly seven? About four or five months. Maybe six. When is six out coming? We will be dropping on June 1st for summer. Summer vibes. We just got to make sure we see what they talking about on... um crazy in love first you know what i'm saying then we got to come with our side of the story because they got a side and then we got a side and then y'all got a side so we're gonna put it all together just like that well why do you have my weave hair <laughs> you spilled oatmeal on my leftover good hair you, you, you just could rub me you just could give me some money for that and then you could throw that away <laughs> I love you too, girl. I'm so excited. My hair is done. My scalp feel good. I think I'm gonna leave this in for like the whole six out, which I think. Is is Prashan Mama going to make some money with that show? She better. <laughs> All the mamas better make some money. All right, y'all. Um. We got meetings today. We got to get up and get dressed and get out of here. I'm just got a couple here. More, more interviews coming up. But that baby, I just want to hop on here and say that Megan James, honey. Now that that's a good, that would have been a good. That never mind, never mind. Bye bye now, y'all. <laughs> All right, you heard what Miss Carlos I had to say. Now let me know your thoughts. Thank you so very much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And if you have any hot tea for me, message me on Instagram. I love you guys. Bye.